kids, welcome to Banky Science. I'm Professor TJ. And her assistant, Nelly Welly. And today we have an awesome experiment for you. Yes, you. But before we start, let me tell you something about this experiment. Water can certainly move in mysterious ways. Guess the water from one cup to make its way up a hill and back down into a second empty cup with the help of paper towels and an interesting scientific process. Okay. This is what we will require. Water, two glasses, absorbent paper, food color. And remember kids, always have an adult present as you're doing this experiment. Safety first. All the time. So now you're ready. Yes. Ready to start? Yes. So what we're going to do, we are going to do now. You see this food color? Uh -huh. So I want you to put some food color into this glass. Just a little bit of food color. And that's enough. Cover it. Then, I'm going to take, take the water uh -huh. and pour some water into, yeah, into the glass. That's enough. Okay. Then, we're going to make something that looks like a pipe also with our hand towel. Pipe or pipe? Or like a toy. Your paper rope starts getting wet. After a few minutes, you will notice that the empty glass is starting to fill with water. This process is called capillary action. The water uses this process to move along the tiny gaps in the fiber of the pulp. Yee. It occurs due to the adhesive force between the water and the paper being stronger than the cohesive forces inside the water itself. This process can also be seen in plants where moisture travels from the roots to the rest of the plant. Have you seen how the water moves from one cup to another? Yeah. Isn't that cool? Magic. <laughs> Not magic, but science. Science. I hope you at home were able to do this experiment like we were. This is all we have for today. See you next time on Funky Science. Bye.